And so the first ever Manchester Derby FA Cup final is underway. Up goes Haaland. So much expected of him today. Drops here for Gundogan! It is a thrilling start for Manchester City. The fastest ever goal in an FA Cup final. What a hit. Technically perfect from Ilkay Gundogan. In from De Bruyne. Oh, bullet header from Rodri. Just wide of the near post. Fabulous start this from City. It's Haaland. Been relentless and Haaland stretches. Couldn't quite connect. Haaland. Some help there from Gundogan, but great strength from Haaland. Always rising, but he's starting to get more and more involved here, Erling Haaland. And the second. He's lofted into Rashford. Wasn't the contact he wanted. Flick wide from Marcus Rashford. De Bruyne. Now Bernardo Silva. Here's Kevin De Bruyne! David De Gea is a bit slow getting across here. This might just have crept in. There's Bruno Fernandes. Ooh, there's half an appeal there for a handball against Grealish. The left hand was raised. Paul Tierney across to look at it. Penalty. To make it 1-1, it's Bruno Fernandes! Just nerveless. Fantastic spot kick. Grealish. A roll through here for John Stones, and now De Bruyne, now was he clipped? Paul Tierney was in a good position. That is mighty close. with the free kick, he moves it to the edge of the area, good to add again! I think De Gea's unsighted here, and Gundogan strikes for the second time. Through a crowd of players and in, 2-1 City. Gundogan. towards Kevin De Bruyne! De Gea makes the save, he just didn't catch it as he wanted. There's Bruno. A bit of space now for Marcus Rashford. And we know what he can do from there. Sure, Garnacho. He's Alejandro Garnacho to cut inside and so nearly bend it into the far corner. He's made a real impact since coming on. <laughs> Getting desperate now. Pumped in again from short. Well, that might drop for McTominay. Varane's in there. Off the crossbar, McTominay! Couldn't keep it down. Surely the final chance. It belongs today to Manchester City. FA Cup winners 2023. There's no feeling quite like it. And can they repeat it all again next week?
It's been a top-class performance from them today. They had their moments right at the end of the game where they were under a bit of pressure. But overall, they thoroughly deserved their victory. They showed all their tactical awareness, all their technical quality. And those fans can go away from the stadium knowing another trophy is in the cabinet. And they survived conceding their only goal in this FA Cup run, the penalty from Bruno Fernandes, which levelled the count. But they came again, and the shared silverware reward for an amazing amount of work that goes into it. The training ground started in August where they actually lost the Community Shield to Liverpool, a game that was played at Leicester. That might have even been in July, actually. And here we are in June. It's been an odyssey, and it ain't over yet. As those players will be quick to tell everybody when they do their interviews afterwards. But special moments for Manchester City. A very special team with a genius of a manager, a winning machine. And I think you've hit the nail on the head. A genius of a manager. That's what Pep Guardiola is. He's inventive, he comes up with new ideas, he gets the best out of his players. What a coach, what a manager, and what a team Manchester City are. Gareth Southgate right behind. Pep Guardiola. I don't think he needs the P on the chest to let us know who he is. A strategist, a perfectionist, and players who don't always get the right kind of decisions in terms of selection. But he's found this group, it'd be a surprise if the Champions League at Edison will be back in goal for the final, I'm sure. Although Ortega did very well today and set up uh, in great part the opening goal after 13 seconds. They're taking it home. They are... Manchester City Football Club and Manchester v City can rightly claim at the moment to be the football capital of England So those are the moments that you play for. Those are the moments that you dream of. Those are the moments that Manchester City hope they have again. This time next week, just about, in that Champions League final against Internazionale. But they will savour the rest of these moments and how special it must be, Clive, to go up and uh, get that FA Cup, get that trophy and hold it aloft. And, of course, what is now a half-full Wembley. A wonderful day for Manchester City and their players, Erling Haaland. All smiles, what a first season he's had at Manchester City. Top goal scorer, Premier League winner, FA Cup winner. Quite unbelievable season for Manchester City. Yeah, not bad. And the celebrations will continue here as they line up. And this will be the photograph for the album. Pep Guardiola is going to be in on this one as well, or this is just players only. There's Gundogan, who scored both. Inevitably will be the hero, will be all over the back pages, but John Stones was simply outstanding. His was, in many ways, the performance to take from this game. So here is the photo for the album as Manchester City can celebrate. FA Cup winners 2023.